Hey everybody, what's up? Today we are starting a new series on YouTube here. We are going to be doing a kind of a public works series. So I have a little bit of a shop set up here right now. We don't have much, but we are on Elk Creek, uh, Wyoming map. And I have made us a little shop here. Uh, we're right outside the sign. Welcome to Clearwater, Wyoming. I just thought it'd be cool to have the sign like kind of right in our front yard and have our shop uh, set back and we're still pretty close to the city and the city's right there. I did not realize this was here when I was making it so we're just going to have to deal with that unless I move the driveway or something. I don't know. Maybe I'll put, maybe I'll widen it and then put like a little uh, meeting in the middle. But, uh, like a little, I don't know. But anyways, we're starting a public works series. I got a fuel tank put down. Um, I got to fill that, I guess. I probably should have put it uh, so this one was on the other side of it. But I couldn't tell when I was putting it down. What's this here? Oh, you can just fill it. That's pretty cool. I didn't know you could do that. But uh, anyways, there's our fuel tank. So if we need fuel, we can fill it up here. And we don't have much over here, but we do have a couple buildings to fit all our equipment in. That building over there is empty right now. Uh, I figure we could probably get some more buildings in here eventually. I have a uh, Kenworth T880 with a tilt deck trailer. This is what I hauled our equipment back from the shop with. And I figure we can use this for hauling around our equipment. Uh, this has uh, strobe lights and stuff. I'm going to try and put strobes on all of our equipment so we're visible when we're out working on the roads. We got our truck here. One of our work trucks. One of the city trucks, I guess. A uh, 2020 GMC 3500 HD. This will be released or it has been released. Uh, look for a video on my channel about that if you want the download link. But this is just the work truck, the pro version. We got the strobe lights in front. The strobe lights on the roof. And the strobe lights on the rear bumper. I got the diesel since it is a work truck. But uh, I'd say most like city trucks are gas. But I got the diesel because I wanted the diesel. So in the future, we'll be filling up this shop here. Filling up all the other buildings. Uh, I left this plenty of room here. But anyways, we're going to go out on our first job today. Um, I'm going to make a playlist of all these videos too for a public works project. Uh, projects videos. I did a similar thing in Farm Sim 19. I did a New York State Department of Transportation role play series where I went from tearing down all the trees to building our shop and then going out and doing some jobs. So there's a playlist if you want to check that out. I did a bunch of videos on that. Um, but I would like to do a lot more videos and different types of videos in 22 so uh, yeah I got a bunch of ideas already but anyways so here we have our John Deere uh, Z-Track Z994R mower on this uh, e uh, Loger load trail trailer I almost said eager beaver because I have one of those in the uh, mod for that um, this trailer is kind of small Ideally, we'd want to have a couple mowers, so we'll probably get a bigger trailer. This is just what I got. We can still haul up on a single mower or some random small little things with this trailer. I also got this McConnell mower, uh, reach mower for mowing ditches or whatever. Uh, I converted this from 19. I got a John Deere brush mower, a batwing mower. We'll be using this today. And then we have a John Deere 7810, four-wheel drive. I'm looking into getting a couple more tractors. But right now, this is what we got. Uh, we will be getting some more smaller tractors, some bigger tractors, some tractors with loaders. We're going to get a bunch of tractors. We're going to have all different brands. I know right now we got all John Deere, pretty much, but uh, it's not going to stay that way. This is just a, a small-ish tractor. It's a good-sized tractor we're pulling this uh, brush mower with. So that's why I got it. We also got a John Deere 524K uh, wheel loader. Don't have any immediate need for that right now, but I'm sure we will in the future. And that's all of our equipment right now. So 
we are going to go out on a job, do some mowing. Uh, we are going to just drive the mower, uh, the tractor with the mower there. Because we're the government, we can do that. Um, so we're going to get this hooked up. But before we go drive it out there, uh, we're going to run our truck out there. Get it set up. And kind of blocking off the road. Making sure people are aware we're there. We'll get the strobes going. So here's that. And then we are going to go and close up the door behind us. So we don't have any rats, mice, lions, bears, and tigers moving in here. We need to mow the grass around the shop here too. So originally I said we were going to drive the tractor and mower out there. But we're not. It's a pretty far drive, so we're going to have that dropped off out there. And we're going to run out there with the truck and jump on the tractor and do some mowing. I also thought we could do some plowing eventually. Right now it is August in game, but we can change that. So anyways, we're coming up on our area we're going to mow here. As you can see... Uh, along the areas here, there's a lot of this brush and stuff, and uh, it kind of makes it hard to see. So we're going to come in here with the mower, we're going to mow, and try and cut down some of this brush. So, we are going to park our truck. Um, well, we're going to be start off mowing by the bridge. So we will turn around. We'll head back that way. So this is kind of the area where we're going to mow. All on the right side. We're on the guardrail. I don't think we'll need the reach mower. Actually, we'll put, we'll put our truck right in front of the guardrail. We'll squeak right by this car. So we'll uh, park right here in this little area here. To let people know that we are mowing. Alright, we're good to go. We will shut the truck off, we'll leave the key on, we'll leave the strobes going, so people know that we are here. Alright, so we have arrived at our location here. We're going to clean up the area in front of the bridge, and then we're mainly going to focus on the area behind the bridge. But uh, there's a few little shrubs around here. We'll go ahead and uh, cut these down. Now, most of the time when they're using uh, these mowers, the tractor, they're using like a two-wheel drive tractor. I tried looking for one, and I didn't find one immediately. Oh, it's okay. We'll <laughs> we knocked the sign down. We'll come get that later. We'll throw it in the back of the truck. We'll have to come fix that one of these days. But, uh, yeah, most of the time they use, like, a two-wheel drive tractor for this kind of job. I'm not really sure why. Maybe cost. But, uh, it seems like a four-wheel drive is what you want. But, uh, anyways, we're mowing here. I'll just knock down the tall stuff. I'll come over here. We'll do a quick little pass here. Knock down the tall stuff. And that's probably good there. We'll fold it up and we'll hit the other side. Alright. Let's go ahead and lower it down. Grass is really hilly here and uneven, so... It's a good thing we got this bat wing mower. Just floats right over the terrain. We'll mower on the speed limit sign. Well, I really thought these wings would kind of float. We'll hit the other side, there's our truck.
Watch out for the sign. Don't want to knock that down. Oh. Oh well. It's okay, we got the truck right here. Oh, there's our car. Just sitting there waiting. Right in the back. I wish you could knock down these things. These things are annoying. Oops, we just hit the... Oh, man, we're just smacking into the guardrail. It's okay. Put all this mode down nicely. Looking a little bit better. Can't go too far there. Let's see how far we can go. We should be able to back it down. Oh yeah, right down there. We'll kind of get this. Oh, we got it. All right. We'll get a couple more passes in here. Knock down all these little shrubs. It looks like our truck is actually causing traffic delay, but that's fine. As long as they know that we're mowing, they're not running into us. They can wait. The grass is important. There's literally zero reason for them to be stopped. It's insane the hills you see these guys on these tractors mowing on the roadside though. There's a little brush up here. We'll cut that out. And we'll stop here and turn around. We'll go behind these uh, signs here. Uh, that's kind of a narrow area there. We'll probably have to go hit that with the reach mower. Yeah, this is the most of the shrubbery ends here. The overgrown little bushes. Yeah, we can go around uh, behind all the signs and everything like that. Cut all those down with the, the yellow reach mower we have back at the shop. Could use a smaller tractor for that one, probably. We don't need this big one, but like I said, we're still building up the fleet. Alright, we'll shut the mower up. Oh no, we'll, we got a couple more here. Also might look into getting a uh, mower for the front of the skid steer. Don't have a skid steer yet, but... Should probably get one. Gonna be a necessity for a public works department. You know, we don't need to go too crazy here. We just need the area immediately to the side of the roadway to be clear. pretty good there. We got a couple more brush bushes here. Oh, I guess we can't cut that one down. Uh, we're going to have to cut that one down with a chainsaw. That one's a little too thick to run over. We want to keep it looking nice and tidy down here. After we're done, we'll drive the truck over. Oh, another sign. She's running over signs left and right. Alright, we're going to have to drive the truck over here. Pick up all the signs and pick up that bush. That's what happens when you don't mow often enough.
We don't have to mow too far into here because this is their property. But we'll at least clean it up. And I think that looks pretty good there. So we will go ahead and turn the mower off, fold it up. And we'll park it over to the side here. You can go around. We'll drive down here. We'll put the tailgate down. And let's go get the sign first off. Pick it up, narrow bridge. This is why we drove the truck out here, not just the tractor. We'll put it down there, it's good to go. Readjust that a little bit. We'll reach into the passenger seat. We'll get our chainsaw. We don't want to just leave that out in the open. Somebody comes by and snags it. The city's going to have to pay for a new chainsaw. Alright, so we'll go ahead and cut that down. This is a small little shrub. Should be able to cut off some of these limbs here. We'll just leave those here. They'll decompose and rot away and good to go. I got one little stubborn one. All right, here we go. We'll pick this up. We'll throw it in the back of the truck. Let's go ahead and pick up the other sign. that we knocked over. Probably should put the tailgate up too so we don't lose the sign. We'll just pull over here. We'll send another crew out here to put these signs back up. That was 100% not our fault. The signs are too weak. All right. In you go. There we go, that's good enough. Well, oh, well, kind of. There we go. Alright, we'll put the tailgate up. We'll lock everything down, and we are good to head back to the shop. We'll park our truck here for now. And we're going to run over and grab our mower with the truck. We'll get the beacons going. And I'll check back with you guys when we get out there to pick up the tractor. Alright everybody, we are coming up on our tractor. We'll go over the bridge. And what are we going to do here? We'll turn around in here. Alright, we're pulling over. We'll pull over kind of in front of the bridge here. We got the hazards going. We're looking safe. We'll unfold our trailer. And we'll go run over to our tractor, fire it up. And we'll drive it on and load it up. This is really the way it should be done. It just takes too long to drive out here. Go ahead and carefully drive on. 
just fits on the trailer. Mower fits. Drive up. Shut the tractor down. And we'll strap it down. We're good to go. Jump in the truck. Fold it. And we are good to go. I need to run back to the shop. So anyways guys, thank you for watching. If you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me your thoughts down below. Uh, keep checking back for more of these public works videos. I'm gonna be doing a bunch of them. I got a lot of ideas.